Okay guys, two episodes left. Lelouch is over here like he's gonna rely on Nina. Now does Nina have some type of anti flea deflector or uh, something to counter counteract the flea these flea warheads? Because he's saying he can only rely on her. Now I know the whole reason why he got Nina up in here is because I knew it was either he was going to make her make more weapons for him or get her because she's the one who created the flea hut. Get her to counteract it and and figure out a way to make something to go against it or something. Which was very smart on that part. But I think she's realized, Nina has realized that Schneezel has taken off the limiter, taken off the time thing on her stuff. And she knows, now that she's seen what her stuff can do with the limiter. The fact that Schneezel's removed it has told Nina like, oh shit, he, how can he just easily, how could he do something like that? How could he just be okay with doing something like that? So she probably is feeling like an inside for redemption to, to make up for, cause you know, she feels guilty that she played a role in killing millions of people, millions and millions of people. She's probably like, she's got to do whatever she can to stop Schneezel from using her stuff. All right, guys, let's get started. Episode 24. We're, we're, we're close. I'm so glad Ogie and them are all right, though. Wow. Oh, my God. All these people dying. Is this worth it? Ugh. Oh, Natalie. How? My thing is, how many warheads he got? And I, I hate that Schneezel is using her, but I gotta say, I'm, Schneezel is really impressive. Like, he is... <laughs> he's like one of the best antagonists in the whole show, if you ask me. Now, you got Natalie questioning herself on how can she easily deploy these weapons, knowing the magnitude of, of what these things can do. I wonder, is she gonna stop? Look at all these people dying. Oh, absolute air superiority. Oh wow, they got the ultimate defense. They figured it out how to stop the flea. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. He about to kill the Black Knight? Yo, Schneezel is... I'm sorry, he is that girl. He's crazy. <laughs> wow. Who's firing from behind? Oh my gosh, I could... I hope... Is Suzaku gonna kill Shinge? Oh my gosh, wow. Oh! Oh, Toto! Everybody! Oh! I was about to say, I know he's not about to explode. Damage level 75%? Oh!
Try to, but it's not only gonna be able to do it. Responding to that, you can stop the player from achieving criticality. You have to enter the local environment data within the approx. Oh my god! Oh my god! A uh, what? Oh! Oh, please! Oh! Oh my god, it worked! Oh! My god! You didn't see that coming, Shinizu, did you? How many more flayed warheads y'all got? Get in there. Get up in there before they can fire another one. Oh my god, this is so intense. I like how those butterflies like flew right past her. I wonder what does that mean symbolically. Oh my god. What's the final plan, Shinizel? Wow. Who is that? Oh, it's Gino. Oh, oh boy. They may have to kill Gino. Oh, shoot! This, this is, oh my god. To within Demo- Oh my god, so they're about to leave. So heartbreaking, like this is so fucked. Oh my god. Look at Callan, yo. Callan versus Cece. If they just knew what Schneezel was gonna do, they would all turn <laughs> against him. Oh! Oh 
wow. What? You can see now? Wow. Oh, look how he spun around in the chair. Oh, everybody is Gios. I'm dead. Oh my god. What what if he's like, hell no, nah, I'm about to geos your ass? <laughs> oh my god, Kurt is alive. Wow. Mm. Is that Guilford? Oh, Guilford! Oh my god, Guilford's alive! Yeah, but Shinizo, your form of peace is just... Honestly, guys, I'm just so speechless. What? I figured. I was like, he's probably gonna geos him. Wow. He anticipated those plans and recorded that video. I'm dead. Wow. Wow. Ah. Ah. Wow. Now he gotta find Nunnally quick! Oh. What is that? <gasps> oh my gosh. This? What is he about to tell her? What? Oh my god! Guys, she was able to break... You know what? We've seen signs of this in the past. Of like... If you, if it totally goes against your nature or if your will is strong enough, it's possible that you could break through gas. Yes, we kind of saw that in Yuffie a little bit. Just a little bit. Like it was kind of hinted at a tiny bit at times. I feel like it was hinted at with Yuffie. I don't, I want to say somebody else, but I don't think so. I Honestly, the fact that he foresaw, he knew Schneezel was going to abandon the Democles. Democles, whatever however you pronounce it, and basically be like, okay, well, if you check me, then you can just kill me, whatever. But he's no, he's just like, no, I'm about to geos you. I had a feeling he was like, 
Because Schnitzel is a lot more valuable and useful Gios than he is dead, if you ask my opinion. But I, honestly, I'm just, I'm shocked. I'm so speechless. What? Now, is he going to continue to wear this mask in front of Nunnally or is he going to be honest and truthful? This, this is a good opportunity for him to be honest. <sighs> okay, guys, we are on the final episode of the series of Ko Geass. Honestly, this is a little... I don't even want to watch it because then it'll be over. But I ha if honestly this show I honestly see why there's such a huge fan base for this show. This has been so amazing. The twists, the turns, everything. I'm gonna be sad what I'm gonna be sad when it's over, but there's still the Akito movies, there's still the OVAs, there's the manga. I'm trying to watch all of that. I'm gonna try to put the Kogias movie reactions on the channel. I'm at, now I'm at this point, like, how is Lelouch going to talk to Nunnally? Is he going to be honest? How did Nunnally break through Gias? I really feel like, like, he said her will. Did the, her will break through Charles Gias? And I honestly just, I was speechless for most of last episode, to be honest. Like, it was just so much going on. And honest, it's just, I'm speechless right now. Okay, well, let's just, uh, oh, wow. Look at Nunnally with her eyes open! I know he's not gonna do that, right? She looks so different with her eyes open. She looks so different with her eyes open. It's kind of it's kind of jarring. <laughs> wow. So many people have died for this. It's just I'm honestly just looking forward to how this is going to end. I am just so shocked and I'm so happy Cornelia and Guilford can be together. Like, I'm so happy Guilford's alive. Oh my god. Final turn. Oh. Man, this is like the third fight Suzaku and Callan have had throughout the series. What is it that y'all must do? In that case, what? <laughs> oh man, this is the final battle between them two. I just, uh, I really don't want, I don't want no more people to die. <laughs> Toto, you gotta just sit down. Mmm. Oh, there's like parallels with everybody Constant being controlled by people trying to oppose the system that controls you who have no choice but to join the system okay yeah sit your ass down Toto And every, it's like people are fighting to the death for their ideals, who or what they're fighting for. Everybody's got a perspective. Everybody's got a reason on why they fight. Mm. So everyone can advance into the future. Is he for real? 
You would be crazy if she had the will to not follow through with it. person to fight against Suzaku. Like, they've always been, like... And it's like, now that all their weapons... This is just... They're just, like, evenly matched. Oh, snap! Oh, my god! to go to hand-to-hand -hand combat. Wow. Wow. No way! Suzaku didn't die. Oh my god, don't roll down the stairs. Oh, Nunnally. Oh god. I can't- I don't think Suzaku's really dead. taken over the world wow wow two months later as CEO of the Black Knights and current chairman of the UFM Supreme Council this is this is crazy No way Suzaku's really dead. Suzaku's really dead? I don't think he's dead. I think his he he's pretending to be dead. Um wow. I <laughs> Wow, um I don't even know what to say, y'all. What, they gonna try to assassinate him? What? What happened? Yo, that's probably Suzaku. It's Suzaku! Wow! You know that's Suzaku, how he was dodging those bullets? Is he gonna 
fake his death? Oh my god! Oh, Lelouch! Oh my god, Lelouch! Wow! Oh, she knows he's been lying the whole time. Oh, my God. Is she living with her mom? Wow. 
Wow. Wow, I Wow. He 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 literally ended war. Like she was like all their focus has been put into solving poverty and hunger. You know how I was like, what is this zero requiem plan? Is is everything that you're doing making it in is it worth it? And lo and behold his whole plan was to stage his death publicly so all the hatred that people had for him could be focused on him and there would be a true savior and hero i i'm and no one will ever know that it was him who was zero before except for like the few people that's why he was trying so hard he was like this plan has to work like because if schnezel would have won the whole cycle of war would have continued. Schneezel was just like, yeah, there are going to be many people who are going to be willing to make us flay a warheads, you know? Like, I'm so, wow. That was amazing. That was amazing. That was amazing. I I honestly need time to process what I just watched because I, I watched 23, 24 to 5 all together. I need time to process what I watch and I will be having a series finale 23 through tw uh 20 yeah 23 through 25 discussion i hope you guys will be there and by the time we have the discussion my will have collected my thoughts and i won't be such a mess but can i just say i'm about to hit 100 subscribers and i just want to say guys thank you so much for commenting I see the passion in y'all's comments about this show and I can clearly see why. I uh, thank you so much for taking the time to watch. Thank you so much guys for the new subscribers y'all have subscribed. Um, thank y'all for watching. Thank you for p taking the time out of y'all's days to like express, tell me what's going on, y'all's theories, y'all's feelings about the show. I am so moved right now. That was, I was, how tragic that's so tra how tragic lucia's story is so tragic like uh, but you know what i will say though i'm so happy he didn't die and not only not knowing what he did like she would have to have relied on other people to like tell her what he did or something i'm glad she was able to touch him and like see everything whatever that ability she has i'm so happy she was able to feel his love and really know his true self in his final moments and i feel like that's what made lelouch happy in the end although i do think he was he had accepted not only he accept he may have accepted not only not ever knowing he was happy as long as she could live in a world where she is the emperor and she lived in a world of peace and he was able to do that well that was that was beautiful that was wonderful but i just wanted to say like before this gets too long i already know this is gonna be long but thank you guys so much this was an amazing journey this was an amazing journey leave a comment below about what your favorite moment about of the whole show has been or your favorite moment of this season has been um the next show I plan on reacting to is Steins Gate. If you got any recommendations or is there a show, if there's a show that you guys want me to react to, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like the video and look out for announcements on the Discord for when I will be streaming the Code Geass discussion for the series finale. I need time to think about everything. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.